I want to build AI features into my application, and I'm going to show you how the new GitHub Models tab in your repositories can help. In fact, this file represents a prompt used by my application to implement these new features. All of my prompts can now be found in this brand new Models tab in my repository. This is the same file we were looking at earlier. I can pick a model, tweak the parameters, change any variables, and run the prompt to understand the outcome. I can make changes to the prompt and commit the changes like any other code. The Compare tab lets you run experiments to understand how variations in your prompts and which models you use affect the output. You may notice that this page already has some sample data, and that's because we included it in the .prompt.yaml file as test data. I can add additional prompts to see side by side how different models, parameters, system and user prompts perform. You can also apply evaluators to quickly see what combinations meet your desired output and see it directly in the dataset grid, which we'll look at in just a moment. The existing evaluator uses an LLM as a judge, resulting in either a pass or a fail. Let's see how the evaluators are shown when running two different variations, in this case, two different models. And we can see here that all four requests both prompts against both inputs have all had that one evaluator pass, as well as some other metadata about each request. Organization admins can allow all models or specify a list to allow or disallow. This is a lovely way to collaborate on prompts with everyone in your team. And once you're ready to implement a prompt in your project, you can use code snippets provided in the models page and use over 40 models with just your GitHub account.